Hello, everybody. This is the Argent Defender, and we are here today playing Quantum Break. Quite excited for this. Um, this is my first. Ooh, we are sinking. So about there. We'll put it to there so we can sort of... Yeah, there, so we can sort of see what's going on in the darkness. We don't want the videos to be too dark. And there's that. Okay. So I've been looking forward to this game since it was announced. The idea of time manipulation. It's pretty awesome. Anyway, every choice you make affects has effects on the future. This icon means you are viewing a direct consequence. So yeah. Now, this does have TV shows. Oh my Christ, that's a... Oh, offline episodes, okay. Holy shit, are they really that big? <laughs> okay, well, apparently after each act we stream a episode of the TV show. I will be recording those TV shows and I will not talk during the TV show, so if you want to see them, look out for them. I'll be labeling them as the live action episodes in the title. So we are going to play on normal, so let's get started as soon as it loads. Assuming it loads. Here we go. Riverport University. Search your surroundings for optional content. There are posters, email messages, documents, and more scattered throughout the world. Ooh. Are you ready, guys? The number one, the number killer, one killer is killer time. time. It destroys us all. This is what you need to know. Time broke. A growing fracture leading to the end of time. We went after a device that could fix it. Things turned ugly. Paul Screen was there to stop us. He has superpowers. Jack. Him and me both. We failed. Jack. And of course... Time travel was involved. Jack. Going too fast for you? Okay. What do you want to cover first? You tell me. Let's start at the beginning. When Let's you first the arrived at Riverport up. University. That's better. I came back home to see my best friend, Paul Serene. He wanted to show me what he'd been working on. My brother Will was a scientist. He was also involved. Paul said it was world changing. He was right. Whoa! Come on! Watch where you're going, man! Fuck off! Get out of the road! Hey, that's the guy who Riverport stood in for... University. Here we are. Hey, thanks for the ride. No problem. Now, for those of you who do not know, that You've guy... been away for six years. Paul and I had kept in touch, but... Well, not so much. How did it make you feel? I was just happy to see Paul. Hey, I know you. Good morning. Yeah. You're the bad guy. Now, because it mentioned posters, I'm actually going to look around. There's one right there, I think. Oh no, those are lights. Oh, that film. Can I get rid of the film grain? Are you serious? There's no. Film grain. I can't get rid of the film grain. That's gonna that's gonna get on my nerves. It makes everything blurry. I guess I should go find Paul. Yeah, I know, but I'm giving backstory. Shut up. The uh the taxi driver's actually the actor who stood in for this guy during the demo. Uh the original demo. <laughs> Rough night, huh? 
just whatever's done doesn't even matter anymore. I'm, I'm, yeah. I doubt he's out here. Better head into the campus. Hmm. Okay. Paul told me to meet him at the physics building. Oh, so it's got an entire open university. Hey, you take action now. Monarch Solutions wants to tear down the pride of Riverport University. Okay. So, narrative objectives. View it. Oh, okay. So, where is the physics building? I don't know what the physics building is. Oh. Jack! Just got to the campus. Where are you? God, it's good to hear your voice. Uh, when you hit the courtyard, look right, you'll see this fancy modern physics building with the lights on. I'll meet you inside there. I am so looking forward to this, man. You still haven't told me what this is. I know. See you soon. Why 4 a.m.? Why not wait till morning? Paul had always been a showman. Hey, do you know where the physics building is? You mean the big ass metallic turtle behind me? Hard to miss, man. Thanks. Oh, sh shut up. Uh, what's this one? Babe, can we go home yet? Okay, yeah, I'm gonna look around because I think there's gonna be a lot more of these. And that is the chick from the demo who's frozen in time. Ah, oh, they're making all these references to their own material. Can I notice how everything's popping in? It's happening because of this damn film grain. It's hiding it popping in. Or at least trying to. Oh, we have posters. Protests seem like a lost cause. No Maybe sympathize with the students. Can I talk to you? I can. If you're with that fraternity, you've done enough damage. We're being shut down. <laughs> Hey, I come in peace. I'm just meeting a friend nearby. At 4 a.m.? Yeah, tell me about it. Well, we're spreading awareness about Monarch Solutions, so if you want to know how badly they're giving us the shaft, then you could just ask me. Can I ask you? Okay, right, let's what's ask. What's going on here? Okay. How would you feel if you knew a corporate monopoly was taking a massive dump all over your personal history? Uh, that's quite an opener. Good. Because that beautiful library over there is over a hundred years old. It's part of the city's heritage. And Monarch Solutions plans to tear it down tomorrow. Do you want to know why? We've got a chart with all the details. Where's the chart? This chart here, which I just looked at. Go ahead, check out the chart. Which chart? This chart? Monarch's tearing down the library to build another research facility. And for what? I bet you're gonna tell me. Hmm, to push their corporate agenda. I mean, look at those numbers. They're slowly taking over the city and everybody's completely blind to it. Uh, it doesn't look good. Hey, I gotta meet my friend, but keep fighting this, okay? All right. Enjoy your booty call. <laughs> Not exactly. <laughs> Is there anything in... Oh, there's a TV show! It's not a lake. It's an ocean. What the shit? He's been gone for five years. Dark matter and dark energy constitute over 95% of our universe. We're just a speck hey, it's Max Payne. Endless ocean of darkness. Is that Alan Wake? Every story finds its writer. Light of the flesh, he's smart. 
miles of wicked sweat he lies in the blood of his face, eyes staring. That's tur that was totally Alan Wake in the uh the flannel shirt. So that's the way I need to go. Is there anything else? Can I like go have a look at the statue? No. Okay, well that's enough for now. Let's move on. Well, I've always been hungry for success. Driven. He made it onto a lot of those top young professionals lists. And now he was coordinating some huge project at the university. It's a big deal for him. Hey, protest's over. At home. I'm not now a protester, sir. Holster that safety whistle. Prick. <laughs> Can I go have a look at the, um... The, the crazy-looking modern art statue? Is there gonna be, like, a hidden something around the corner? No. Tell you what, if this didn't have the film grain, it would be a very pretty game, but I have a feeling they put the film grain here on purpose to hide all the uh, texture bloops, which is kind of annoying. But I'm just going to shut up now and enjoy the game, because, you know, that's what games are for, to be enjoyed. And we have new ones. Dr. Kim Memorial article. Nice. Hmm. That's the dude. That's exactly the bad modest. guy. Are we, Paul? Wait, he knows the guy who's. You made oh, a long trip that's a just to see a research project. Well, reading between the lines, Paul was under a lot of pressure. <laughs> he needed a friend. I wanted to help him any way I could. Son of a bitch. Jack Joyce. In the flesh. The esteemed Mr. Paul Serene. I'm shaking money bags. Shut up and bring it in. <laughs> Welcome home. Six years. Now we're starting to think you'd never come back. Yeah, me too. Come on. First, though, let's look around. This way. We're going upstairs. Too bad I'm going. How was the I'm going this way. First class. Thank you for that. It's a step up from our van trip to Utah. I'm guessing that Will's not meeting us. He doesn't know we're here. I knew Paul had asked my brother Will to consult on his project. Will was all the family I had, but he was difficult. Incident? Jesus, Will. What you do this time? Backstory about the brother. That's nice. Is that anything else Yo, to Paul, look at? You think you got enough space here? Well, you know, us business types need somewhere to practice our putting. <laughs> Can I enter these offices? Please, that looks like it's something I should be looking at. No. I can look at this, though. The campus. Ooh. Quite the facility you got here. What can I say? I have a knack of milking money out of wealthy investors. In here, Jack. Going up. Calm down. I'm busy. Protests against Monarch are going strong, I see. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised you didn't join in. I thought that kind of trouble was your forte. Well, it used to be our forte. You're the one that sold out. Oh, I don't know. Rich and successful isn't too bad. You should give it a try. Come on, get in the get There's in the elevator, you do. Is it about my brother? I still worry about him, huh? If Will did something wrong, then Jack, man. Look, I've been tight-lipped about this for a reason. This project we've been working on. He's going to change the entire world. Uh, why do I smell one of your long-winded presentations on the horizon? I Is that never... safe? Oh, look. The... 
a perfectly placed presentation to illustrate the project. Now, who put that there? <laughs> oh, shot. Okay. Enough joking. The lab's this way, Jack. Come on. I'm busy. I can't go around the tables. Actually, I wouldn't mind Come watching your presentation. Let's get to the big show. You haven't changed at all. Damn it! Go back to the checkpoint. <laughs> I wanted to watch this presentation, guys. Come on. No, I'm watching your presentation. You told me to. We'll get to your lab. I want to see your presentation. I know you love this stuff. Come on, man. Dazzle me. Well. If you insist. Progress. Our primary drive is a species. Over time, we have cured life-threatening illnesses. Explore the world. Oh, good. Going into marketing spiel mode. Don't ruin my flow. But there is one element which denies us true progress. Time itself. Now, I'm not a scientist, but here's how it's being explained to me. We've known that, in theory, a rotating black hole creates a deformation in space-time, potentially allowing travel through both space and time. Years ago, William Joyce, your brother, posited the existence of chronon particles, now known as Meyer-Joyce particles, which fill an all-encompassing field, enabling the constant and steady progression of time. Here at Project Promenade, we have combined both these theories to discover a way to manipulate that field. And the results are staggering. There's more. Oh my. But that's enough of a primer for now. He doesn't look impressed. All right, let's do this. Now, before so we this go is down about there. Quantum physics. Paul, you know my brother spent years stuck down that rabbit hole. Is that why you brought Will on as a consultant? When Dr. Kim passed away, your brother was the obvious choice to bring in to replace him. I bet he was, but first, can I look at blue? No. Okay, I need to get on with it. I need to get on with it. It's been 15 minutes already. Well, actually, no, it's 20 minutes now, and we've barely done anything. You look so serious, bro. All the lights went out. What the shit? Welcome to Project Promenade. Oh. Oh shit. You guys must have some budget. What is all this? The future, Jack. You are looking at the biggest discovery of our time. It's impressive, but Will's the scientist. What do you need me for? There's a reason we're doing this at 4 a.m., Jack. I need someone I can trust. I need you to help me convince Will. Yeah, I had a hunch. When your brother found out the scope of what we were building here, he... Well, you know Will. Yeah. Hang on, I gotta get something from my desk. Will overreacted. Scared off the investors, ranting about miscalculations, dangers, all with no evidence. It works, but they're going to cut our funding if I don't prove it. So let's go prove it then. Jack, you know asking for her help is not easy for me. I am in deep trouble. You see, the tests I have to run here are not strictly speaking legal. You're the only one I can trust to help me with this. Whatever Will did, I want to make it right. I love my older brother, but he didn't make it easy. It's already essentially set up. Anyone can do it, but you're the one I want to do this with. Jack, thank you. I knew I could count on you. Oh, oh, we got something else. An iPad. Oh, it's the email that they... That's cool. I assume I can find all this again, right? Um, collectibles. 
Ah, I missed one outside. So I've got one more left here, which is this one. Come so, here. So, what's this? Corridor schematics. Travel clockwise leads to a forward progression in time. Counterclockwise, travel backwards. Oh, it's like you invented a clock. Yes, years ahead of our time. I need you to push the lever over there, labeled Chronon Conduit. That'll activate the core. I'm gonna run diagnostics and make sure it remains stable. There we go. <laughs> That's just the Chronon Conduit initiating. You can see the black hole inside. Are you sure it's supposed to do that? Stable. What was that? The core replicates the effects of a rotating micro black hole, so activating it can be a bit intense. A black hole? What exactly are we testing here? You're about to find out. This way, we've got to raise the corridor. Just like old times, eh? Slightly illegal, moderately reckless. Oh, look at that! I'd raise some hell like distorting past. everything. I could tell this was different. Still, I didn't understand how massive and far-reaching the consequences for this would be. How could I? I knew Paul. He played it cool, but I could tell he was nervous. What's happening? We're really doing this, Jack. It's going to be amazing. Here, take this. You need this key to activate the corridor. Well then, let's activate the corridor. Step away, step back. That's annoying. We need to turn the keys at the same time to activate. Security precautions. Ready? It's like we're launching a nuke. Wait, we're not launching a nuke, right? One way to find out. Three, two, one. God damn, Paul. What is this? The corridor. The passenger enters one end, travels around the loop, exits the other, and arrives at the predetermined time in the physical location where the machine is situated in that time. Passenger? Wait, wait, wait. This is a corridor for... You're actually going inside that thing? In the machine, through time. I'm going to be the first, Jack. And you're my witness. This is crazy, Paul. I and mean, this can't be safe. What happens when... Our team has already proved it works in the trial phase. It is ready. We've passed every test, every inspection. We're about to make history, Jack. All you have to do is hit that switch. Two minutes to the past. Remember this moment. Paul, <laughs> what? How? It's, <laughs> it's fine. It's okay. Stay calm, Jack. Stay calm. There's. There's two of you, you just fucking multiply. This is exactly what was supposed to happen. That's, he's, he's me, a future version of me from two minutes in the future. <laughs> Your evil future self. We did it. Fucking incredible. I mean, just imagine the implications. We could warn people about disasters before they disasters happen. Before they happen, cure, cure diseases, diseases before, before they, they spread. spread. I just had this conversation. <laughs> Still sounds good second time. Jesus Christ. Now get in the machine. the machine. You need to complete the cycle. Yeah. Yes. Of course. Wait, Paul. What are you doing? It's all a big loop, Jack. I need to enter the machine and travel back to the moment I exited the machine in order to, well, be here. 
And what if you don't? There is no what if. I'm here, it's already happened. You saw it, Jack. We did it. Oh, that's impossible. That's that's literally impossible. I mean, I can't even... There's no time to stop now. We need to test the other direction. Set the machine to five minutes to the future. What are you doing? You have to help me with this. We have to shut this thing down now. No, 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 stop him! Shut up! Wait, hold, hold on, the core. hold on! We can't shut it down, Paul's still in there. Well, shut up! Look shut at me. up! Look at me! Put the gun down and we can talk, okay? No, there's no time. You're not thinking straight. Put the gun down! Jesus Christ, Will. Time is going to end. Jack, you have to trust me. For what? Oh, no, 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 no.